What up, what up, what up, you guys? It's Blackwing2040 back with another video for you for you guys. And for this video, I'm actually doing a little something a little different. I wanted to, you know, give something back to you guys. What I mean give something back, I'm not, like, share a little something, something to help you guys get, you know, something you guys might be interested in or knowing or finding out. So, everyone... All you guys know who are, you know, subscribed to here know I'm a big, huge Power Rangers fan. And what you, what I also started watching, though, in the past almost two years, or pretty much year and a half, was I started watching Super Sentai. And I bet you're wondering, Blackwing, what the heck is Super Sentai? Well, I'm glad you asked. <clears throat> Super Sentai is actually the original source material of where Power Rangers adapt most of their seasons from. It's a franchise that started in Japan back in 1975 and has been going on ever since. They've been just killing us in the game. And pretty much, it's their franchise. We, ju we just adapt it, pretty much. And it's part of the tokusatsu kind of genre. And what tokusatsu is, tokusatsu is a Japanese drama with special effects. Pretty much simple as that. Like you know, explosions everywhere, CGI. You know, you know, special colorful effects, and <clears throat> and pretty much shows that fit in this kind of genre are like shows. Pretty much Super Sentai is one of them. Um, Common Rider for those who know what Common Rider is. There will be another video about that later on, and then you have. Ultraman, which I don't know much, I don't really know anything about, you know, Ultraman or anything, but other than that, pretty much, I want to, you know, help you guys get into Super Sentai. If, you know, if you're ever in the thought of wondering, like, I wonder how, you know, this season is done compared to its Power Rangers counterpart. So, I want to give you guys some Super Sentai like starting off points or slash suggestions if you'd be interested. So, for me, how I got started into Super Sentai, it's it's a weird, funny story, kind of you know how you know this kind of started out. I was scrolling through YouTube and you know just looking up YouTube videos. I typed in Power Rangers and this video came up called Power Rangers <laughs> Epic Battle, and I clicked on it. And I just see every single Power Rangers team ever. And this is back this is back then I didn't know what the heck this was. I didn't know what I was watching. I was like I was like, whoa, what is this? And then to my surprise, I learned that's part of a franchise called Super Sentai. And that fight was also the first episode of Gokaiger. And who you guys know Gokaiger is, you know. The 35th Super Sentai season, and here in America it was our adaption called Power Rangers Super Mega Force, but we don't talk about that. Anyway, so Gokaiger was kind of somewhat my first introduction to Super Sentai, but I didn't watch the whole season of because I didn't know where to watch Super Sentai. And then this whole another video came out with the entire battle period with like every Sentai team. Every extra ranger, every six ranger, every ranger in Sentai history from the beginning to go Kaiju. I was like, this looks amazing. And so I kind of had my doubts around the time. And plus, this is like around the time when Saban got the rights back to his franchise. And that's this was back when, you know, Power Ranger Samurai was still airing. So that's how I got my first glimpse into Super Sentai and what it was. But it didn't appeal to my interests. But... Later on in 2016, that's when I decided, you know what, why don't I give Super Sentai a shot? So, I did. And the first season I started with was Gosei Sentai Die Ranger. And what Die Ranger is, Die Ranger is the, um, I'm trying to go by numbers in my, I'm trying to go by numbers in my head, that's a bad idea. Um, but, um, Die Ranger is the season... It was, it was pretty much adapted into Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Season 2. That's where the White Ranger suit came from. But in Die Ranger, we actually have a full team with different suits. And this team, the, the story, the characters, just everything about it. 
Die Ranger was just awesome. And for my first like full Sentai season that I watched, I I was immediately hooked. Just just hooked onto it. So and from then on, I started watching other series like Ginga Man, that's the Sentai counterpart of Lost Galaxy. Gal Ranger, Sentai counterpart of Wild Force. Hurricane, which was Ninja Storm. Alba Ranger, which is Dino Thunder. And and the cycle keeps going on and on and on. If you guys want to know what other Sentai seasons I watch, you could ask me in the comment section below. I'll be happy to tell you. But other, anyway, I want to give you like suggestions if you know if you're interested in giving giving you know Super Sentai a watch. One one season, um, fan Sentai fans do recommend is Chojin Sentai Jetman. And I should have said this before. I know I don't have any images or anything to explain this because I can't. Because Toei, the company that owns Super um Super Sentai, it's they're very protective about their property. So I don't want to get a copyright strike from them. And it's just you know you get you get the gist. But other than that, <clears throat> Chojin Sentai Gentleman it <clears throat> it's one of Super Sentai's most popular seasons. It's very it's very, I would say it's very mature, it's very dark, it has a great story in it, it has, it's just awesome. I haven't watched it yet, but that's to, that's what other, you know, Super Sentai fans recommend. Jetman is a strong season. A little history, history or trivia, that was originally going to be our Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, but that all changed. So, that... Jetman is like a season that's before Zoo Ranger, and Zoo Ranger is the Sentai, you know, counterpart of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, Kuryu Sentai Zoo Ranger. And if you want to see how you know Mighty Morphin got started on, got started, you could also start off with um with Zoo Ranger, and it also gives you a different twist and everything. It's very different, but you know you have the you have the dinosaurs in there, you have you have Rita that's in there, but she's not called Rita. She's called Ban Bandora. So it's gonna be interesting. And the Green with Evil story arc in that in that show, it's way different than it was for us in Power Rangers. So I recommend you know Jetman, Zoo Ranger, um, Die Ranger definitely. If you guys want like more martial arts based seasons, Die Ranger is definitely the way to go. Um, Geki Ranger. Geki Ranger is the Japanese version of Jungle Fury, and boy, Geki Ranger, it's so, so good. So, if you love, like, good action scenes and good fights and martial arts, Geki Ranger and Die Ranger are your cup of tea, definitely. If you want something that's more, if you want something with a serious story that's just dark and just, like, strong, Jetman is one, um... Time Ranger is definitely one. Time Ranger is the Japanese version of Time Force. And Time Ranger, oh my gosh. Time Ranger is great. It's just it, it's just so awesome. If you want something more on the on the more comedic side, you could try um Gekiso Sentai Karanja. That is the Sentai adaptation the set no, not adaptation that is the sentai season based off of um power rangers turbo and if you guys want to know why ranger fans really don't love really don't like power rangers turbo even though there are a fair share of pa ranger fans that do love it car ranger is the reason why you know turbo was the turbo was the reason why um power rangers was almost canceled so if you want to know the reason why check out um car ranger and you'll see why you know it worked in Japan, but it didn't do well for us here. So definitely add Car Ranger to your list. You want, you know, just like something with a good story and a good cast. You have, um, well, not good cast, but something with just like a good amount of story. Oh, I almost forgot. Shinkenger. Samurai Sentai Shinkenger. That's the Sentai of <clears throat> Power Ranger Samurai. And when I watched Shinkenger for the first time, I felt like this just made Samurai look like something else, but jeez, that's that's all. Shinkenger was just awesome. So yeah, you could definitely add Shinkenger to your list. And oh my gosh, I forgot something else. Something that's more comedic. 
on the other end is Engine Sentai Goanger. That is the Sentai version of Power Rangers RPM. RPM is way serious in tone compared to Goanger. Goanger is more comedic. It's fun. It's silly. It's it's definitely it's for the kids, and it's way different to what RPM is. But yeah, if you want um. If you want to check out the other dinosaur seasons, like, you know, Abaranja, that's the Sentai season of Dino Thunder, definitely a good watch, so I recommend that you check that out. Kyuuger, that's the Sentai adaptation of Dino Charge and Dino Supercharge. It's really, it's it's good. Kyuuger is really good. And, of course, I gotta recommend Gokaiger, of course, that's like the go-to Sentai season that everyone recommends, but I wouldn't request jumping right into Gokaiger that quickly, because Gokaiger has a lot of tribute episodes in its show, and you're not going to get most of the references, and they make a whole lot of callbacks to the past seasons, so I recommend watching some season just to get some Sentai seasons under your belt, and then you can head into Go Gokaiger, because that's what I did. I watched, I built myself up into Gokaiger, because I know what Gokaiger was all about. And, um, let's see, if you want something more like, if you want more like a space kind of season, check out Q-Ranger, Uchu Sentai Q-Ranger, is, uh, that season just recently ended earlier this year, and it's a really great show, it's, sent, it's Super Sentai's first ever space season, and it's, it's just awesome, so, I know for a fair share to my, all my fellow Power Ranger fans out there, I know we all have our fair share of favorite seasons like SPD, we have Dino Thunder, some have Ninja Storm, Lost Galaxy, you know, Wild Force. This, there's a whole plethora of um, Sentai seasons that you guys can check out. So, pretty much, if you want other recommendations, I'll be happy to give them to you. So, you know, I gave you guys plenty of options to choose from, like Jetman, Zoo Ranger, Die Ranger. Um, let's see, Kaku Ranger is a good one. I almost forgot about Kaku Ranger. Nip for ninjas. I I I, keep, I should have had this like written down on paper or something. But Kaku Ranger is the Sentai adaptation of um of Power Ranger, Mighty Morphin Alien Rangers. Remember how Alien Rangers was only ten episodes long? Kaku Ranger is the real deal. In Kaku Ranger, they're not aliens. They are ninjas, okay? So, if you want to check out Kaku Ranger and how it differs from Alien Ranger, definitely check out Kaku Ranger. So, yeah. Um, Jetman, Zoo Ranger, Kaku Ranger, Die Ranger, Time Ranger, Hurricane Ranger, Abba Ranger, Bokenger, the Sentai um, version of Operation Overdrive. It's kind of similar to Overdrive, but Bokenger does it way better than you know overdrive did because i mean i didn't think overdrive was a bad season i just you know it was it was cool to me i just didn't think it was a bad season i don't understand why it gets so much hate but bokenger is a good place geki ranger is a good season go onger shinkenger go kaiger kiryuger of course we have um beast morphers that's coming out next year so if you want to check out go go busters i'm about to say ghostbusters <laughs> go busters you can definitely give that a watch so yeah this i gave you guys like so many suggestions to choose from you know if you want to you know comment on you know which particular if you want like say you have a favorite power ranger season and you want to check out that sentai um the sentai version of that particular season i'll be happy to um um reply to you guys in the comment section below so Thank you guys for taking time to watch this, you know, introduction to Super Sentai video. Hopefully you guys check this, check it out. And on a side note, before, before I close out, my buddies at that hashtag show, they do, um, Sentai discussions. They have a, a after show called the Henshin Hangout, where they talk about, well, Sentai shows and, um, Kamen Rider. I will do a Kamen Rider an introduction to Common Rider video sometime later on down the long run. But right now they're discussing not discussing. Right now they're currently talking about the current Sentai show which is Lupin Ranger versus Pato Ranger. It's pretty much a cops and cops and robbers kind of show. And it's really good. So I also can you could also add that to your list. 
So I will leave a link to that hashtag shows um um Henshin Hangout playlist so that way for you guys because they did a whole they discuss all of Q Ranger like every single episode of Q Ranger and they're also talking about Common Rider Build the current Common Rider series that's on right now so hopefully you guys check that out and also give that hashtag show a subscribe and tell them Blackwing sent you. <laughs> So, thank you guys for taking time to watch. Comment below if you have any questions on what Sentai seasons you want to get into. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until then, I'm Vengeance, I'm Darkness, I am Blackwing. Stay golden.